Okay guys, Jace here again, got another great video for you. The question today is, how many properties do I need to retire comfortably? Very broad question, because everyone's different. Uh, what are your current financial goals? They're, they're different for everyone. Uh, what is your starting point? Are you actually in a very strong financial position in that you've got heaps of cash or heaps of equity in a very strong borrowing capacity? And how much time do you have? Obviously, if you're very close to retirement, if you're working with a much shorter time frame and really need to get a hustle on as opposed to someone who's starting very early, uh, you know, very early in their 20s. One of the other things that we need to look at is, well, what most people tend to set as a goal in terms of a retirement strategy, it seems to be this magical figure. Most people talk to us about having an income of around $100,000. So to put this into perspective and what that means for you in terms of the number of properties you might need, in order to generate an income of approximately $100,000, you're going to need at least $2 million with equity. Because if you look at the rental returns of roughly 5% on those properties, that equates to 5% of $2 million equals that $100,000. In order to generate $2 million with equity in your investment portfolios, you've got to have enough leverage, you've got to have enough properties. So your short-term target should be to, to aim for at least six properties. It's only 5% of investors out there that actually have six properties or more, but that really needs to be your short-term target. And then depending on how long you hang on to those properties will determine on how close you come to generating that equity to achieve that $100,000. But for most people that we talk to, $100,000 is a typical goal to aim for in terms of retirement income. Got great e-books on this, got great videos on this. Come to the workshops and get educated. Thank you.